Okay, we're going to look at some more of the MIDI features that are very important to know for most musicians who are doing any MIDI work whatsoever. Now we're looking at the key editor. We've already seen the score editor, but for most musicians, this editor is much faster to use and you don't need to have a rigorous education in music to understand it. Now, let's say we've got a part and everything sounds great except there's one note that we just shouldn't have played. Simple enough. You would go up to your eraser, left click it, and go to the note and simply left click over it, it's gone. I'm going to undo that, put it back. And now let's say we actually wish we had played one note. And instead of going all the way back and dubbing in one note, go up, select your pencil or draw tool, go to the note itself, left click, hold down your mouse, and pull it to the length that you would like to have that play. And there we have a note. Now you have the ability, by going back to your object selection tool, right clicking on that, to change the velocity or edit any way you would like, including to change the velocity or the quantize. For instance, let's say you placed it in the wrong location, no problem. If you quantize that section to, let's say, eighth notes, you would just go up to MIDI and over quantize that note. 